Hello, everyone, and welcome to City Beat, where your only English language television guide about arts and entertainment in the city. I'm Michelle, your host for the show. Now, let's get started with today's top headlines. Today on City Beat, we'll see what happens when you heat up a little sand when you visit a master glassmaker. You don't need to travel far to experience Europe. Join Lifestyle Beat on a culinary adventure. And some people just can't live without them. We look at how the Pocket PC has changed our world. All this and more coming right up. Glass is everywhere and the uses are many, so much so that we may even take glass for granted. However, there is this one man that has taken the process of glass making and turned it into an art. His exquisite creations have earned him places in galleries. Today we meet this artisan, take a look at his work and learn more about glass making. This is just one of the many variations of glass art. In 1987, Wang Xiaojun, then in his 30s, traveled the great distance from Taiwan to Detroit in America to study the art of glass making. In just one year, he was ready to set up his studio, the first of its kind in China. The craft of glass making, which had diminished during the Qing Dynasty, was once again revived. There are more than 10 methods to shape glass, including fusing, casting, and blowing. But the one that most intrigues Wang Xiaojun is that of lost wax casting, an ancient and difficult method and rarely used today. Each piece is cast from an intricate and precisely shaped wax model, and during the more than 40 steps, the artist must display great skills of patience and perseverance. This是中光系列大概做了将近四年 A very important difference in this form of glass art from other styles is that the last steps take place in the oven and they're completely out of the artist's control. Wang Xiaojun feels that the difficulties of this method bring out the beauty and strength of Chinese culture. In fact, when I first saw the work, it looks some of it looks like uh, Chinese jade, nice ch Chinese jade. Um, you can also see some themes that are quite similar to Chinese painting, uh, particularly some of the mountain landscape. The artistic beauty of glass is found in a delicate balance between strength and fragility. Wang Xiaojun's latest collection, Multicolor Fragments, reflects his thoughts on the subtle relations between glass and culture. Uh, 塑造成型 Hundreds of pieces of glass are added to create a single form, yet retain the jaggedness of the individual pieces. Like people, each piece will have its own personality. Bu 
管是多彩多姿，我们从典雅的这个造型里面呈现出一种更斑斓、更苍劲的一种美感，而且从风光这个系列里面，从太湖石、从盆景的这个意象美感经验里面做的新的诠释，无非是希望能够，呃，从文化里面找到养分，让这个文化借这个玻璃最特殊的一个跟光的互动，让它发光，所以让文化发光，我想玻璃最最给我最大的这个魅力。An artist can sometimes spend months of painstaking effort to develop the full potential of a glass piece. But his reward, and the reward of those who view the finished art, is spectacular. Coming up soon, those pieces of technology that fit into the palm of your hand and get us through the day. Shanghai for you on City Beat.